What's up, everyone? It's Bethany again, and we have another episode of Ask Disney Programs. We're back with Brittany and Cortland, and you guys know, we're three alumni here. We've done the program too. So today we're gonna talk everything about the Disney Programs experience. We are gonna share some of our favorite memories from our programs, and we're also gonna go over some tips and advice so you guys can really make the most of your program and begin the journey too. So let's get into it. Let's start this off by just talking about our experiences. So what about you guys? Why did you apply? I never thought about working for the Walt Disney Company. It had never been in my path. I happened to be on campus and I saw that there was a recruiter for the Disney College program. My roommate at the time was dying to go see it and she was my ride for the day. So I was like, okay, well, I guess we'll go over and see the presentation. And I was sitting there and the recruiter was talking about all the different aspects of the program. And I kid you not, I had chills, like goosebumps. And I was like, I have to do that. So as soon as we got home, I applied for the program. I got in. I defined deferred my grad school application. So it really wow. changed the course of my whole life. I came down only knowing one person, which was my college roommate, and I left with so many different friends, lifelong friends. So I think everyone comes to the program for different reasons. And mine truly was to uh, build relationships with people from not only from the United States, but across the globe as well too. So that's kind of why I did it and why I applied. What about you, Cortland? So ever since I was younger, I absolutely loved uh, the Disney Company, um, not only because of the experiences and the, of course, the great entertainment and everything like that, but just because of the, the company and the business model as well. Um, so at the time when I was attending my university, actually a recruiter like myself came to the school and they spoke to me about the Disney College program. Now I heard of the Disney College program and I just didn't know if that was something that was in my wheelhouse that I could personally do myself or if I I would even qualify to, to do that but he you know pulled me to the side and said hey I think this would be a great opportunity for you so I took that leap and I applied and I got accepted and let me tell you it was a great experience absolutely loved my program um, to the point where I ended up staying on with the company afterwards and actually growing on into management before getting into my current role right now so absolutely love uh, my college program experience. How cool is that though? Like you guys started where our candidates and participants start and now you guys are kind of giving back to this next generation of participants and you're the recruiters who get to talk to them and tell them about all that waits for them once they begin their program. It's a big honor. For That's sure. really cool. Absolutely. So Disney programs are built on these three pillars of living, learning, and earning. But what else makes a Disney program unique from other internship opportunities? I think there's one big thing that comes to mind for all of us, and it's the company perks, right? So Absolutely. as you talked about being able to go into the parks uh, free when you're not working, right? So like before your shift, after your shift, on your days off, you have an opportunity to go to our theme parks or you know Disney Springs for our incredible discounts for cast members as well. Within the company and with the, within the program specifically, we have all these uniquely Disney events mm -hmm. for our cast members on the program. Uh, I think of, for example, we just had our program celebration, which we have twice a year to really celebrate uh, our participants on the program. And we do a buyout. So this last time we bought out Animal Kingdom and it was just for our program participants. So think about all the attractions, the food, the character meet and greet. So it was truly incredible. It was such a special night. So those are some things that come to mind, those uniquely Disney, uh, those company perks that we get as well too. A second thing that sometimes people don't forget about, but is having Disney on your resume is huge. Yeah. Regardless if you're planning on staying with the company or maybe your, your journey takes you outside of the company, having Disney on your resume is a game changer, right? So I, I can't guarantee you the job, but absolutely when you go into an interview, that recruiter is going to want to talk about your experience at Disney. So we've talked about Disney college programs and the Disney programs experience being a really life-changing experience, but also something that can set the foundation for your future career. So what was that like for you, Cortland? What are some things that you took away from your program's experience? So on my Disney college program, um, there was a lot of transferable skills I gained. Um, communication was a big one. Mm -hmm. I learned uh, how to effectively communicate, definitely when it comes to things that need to get done, things that need to be timely, also, time management was a big thing. Make sure, you know, 
everything is in order and everything is set up um, correctly as well. Um, and when it comes to my current job, you know, we have to go and uh, schedule a lot of things. We got to uh, network and partner with so many individuals. So having where we have those skill sets to be able to go partner and make sure that we do our follow through and everything like that. So there's so many skills that I gained on the college program and that our participants can also gain if they join as well. So we've mentioned that you gain a lot and this is an awesome experience, but I think sometimes being so far away from home or just Disney in general can be really overwhelming to some participants. So I want to know what were some of like the hard days, some of the challenges that you guys faced and what inspired you to keep going on your program to try to overcome those challenges? Awesome. So on my program, uh, you know, it was my first employment opportunity, you know, coming right in, you know, right in college. So first thing was budgeting. It was really important to know that, you know, there's bills you have to take care of for sure. A lot of that is lumped in together, but you have to be mindful of how much money you make and when you need to go get groceries or when you need to, you know, take care of your phone bill and things like that. So the biggest, um, you know, hurdle for me was like understanding what my pay was and then also building, you know, a budget so that I can be able to, you know, not only take care of my responsibilities but also go buy a lot of merchandise <laughs> <laughs> that's a great one so mine was more about like homesickness right so mm, okay. I would say the first couple of weeks of my program man I was having the best time uh, then about that month time frame I started really missing homes missing my animals missing my friends from college and so uh, that was a real struggle for me but I realized like I'm at the most magical place in the world I'm meeting these amazing people I'm having great guest interaction, so I had to really put it in perspective. And a story that sticks out is that I was working uh, Thanksgiving, right? And mm -hmm. I had never been away from my family for Thanksgiving. So I remember calling my mom, and I was a little sad, right? And she was like, Brittany, you know, change your attitude, right? You're in this amazing place, right? You seize this opportunity. And so that's what I did. I kind of turned my frown upside down, right, as they say. And I, we were having a potluck backstage. And so I was like, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna make some mashed potatoes. I'm gonna be involved in this potluck for Thanksgiving. They were terrible mashed potatoes, but <laughs> at least I tried. And I really, we had an incredible time at this potluck. So I really changed my perspective. And then uh, after, I, I remember saying, I never missed my family again. Of course I missed them, but um, I really, this opportunity that I had was once in a lifetime right. and they would always be there. And just, it's like your family away from your family. Exactly. Right? Yeah, exactly. So. My mashed potatoes have gotten better, by the way. Okay, good. That's good to hear. That's good to hear. I think for me, um, one of the challenges right off the bat was connecting and really telling my parents and my advisors, like, okay, yeah, I'm working for parades. I, I tell people where to stand or where not to stand but I was studying communications and I wanted to have this career in PR or events or something. So trying to connect the dots and convince my family, convince my advisors that taking this time away from school was going to be worth it, that it was going to pay off. And so I, I, I still credit a lot of how I present myself and work with people to being in parade audience control. Even if you may be in custodial or food and beverage or attractions, there's still ways that the seeds get planted and you'll use those later on in your marketing career or in finance or even as a recruiter like you guys are now. Yeah, absolutely. It's interesting if you look at all of our different roles to add on to that, right? You were food and beverage on your program. I was front desk, right? So yeah. you really, everyone's path looks a little bit different. So it's interesting to see where you start up doesn't necessarily mean where you're gonna end up in your Disney journey exactly. as well. Exactly. All right, so let's go back to College Brittany and College Cortland. What are some things you guys wish you knew about this program and this experience before you applied? Yeah, so 12 years ago, right? Uh, Brittany was coming down and I felt like a very small fish in a big pond. So mm -hmm. uh, leading up to my program, I had so many questions and I really didn't know who to turn to. Even when I got on my program, I was like, what are my resources? Who can I ask questions to? I, I love now that we've thought of all those. So now we have our support site where you can go on and look at different articles and do your own research, right? Or if there's truly any, you can't find the answer to your question, you can open up a request and it goes to our team or our programs team. And we 
we will get you that answer, right? So it's that hand-to-hand -hand, uh, personal connection. Uh, another thing I love is that we now have our engagement sessions and shameless plug, because Cortland and I lead these, uh, but we have our Welcome to Your Disney program. We have a Countdown to Your Disney program. So really we encourage all of our participants who are coming on a program to jump on these sessions. Not only will you be able to engage with us and each other, but we're gonna be able to go over high level a lot of the different aspects of the program, uh, answer all of your key questions, right? You are gonna uh, feel so much more knowledgeable leading up to your program. So that's something that I really wish I knew is all the different resources and answers to my question leading up to my program. Cortland, what about for you? Awesome, so for me, it was mainly the learning component. So I didn't even know there were so many um, offerings that they have available when it comes to uh, networking one-on-one, -on -one, when it comes to resume building, when it comes to leadership fundamentals, when it comes to so many segments, even when spotlight ons where individuals from across the company, they'll come and they'll talk about their role in the show and they'll um, tell you a little bit of tips about uh, what they do. And I, I wish I knew a lot more of that. And actually, I wish I did a lot more of that on my program because those uh, are very um, transferable towards uh, other roles. This has been so much fun just talking about college program, our memories, reminiscing. Um, so to wrap things up, we are going to share some advice to future participants and to ourselves. So what I wanna know is your current self, what would you tell college program you about what is to come after your journey? So I'll start. I would tell myself that your dream exists. If you don't see it right now, just wait a little bit, focus on what you're doing and make the most of that. But this is the Walt Disney Company and anything is possible. So that means any job is also possible and you can do that too. Cortland, what about you? For me, I would tell, uh, you know, college program Cortland that, you know, have a lot of passion for the company, you know, at the time that you're doing your program, you don't know what you want to do. So of course, staying on with the company, you uh, did a path that um, is not often taken, but it's a path that also has steps to get to leadership and get to growing inside the company. Yeah. So always believe in yourself, believe in your abilities and continue to go forward towards your dreams. That was beautiful. Um, so I would tell little 22-year-old Brittany who came on the program, and my advice, honestly, to any participants coming on a program now or in the future, really be open to opportunities. I came down on my program thinking I was going to move into the events realm, and I did do that for a little bit of time, but I was open, and I said yes to other different opportunities, and you know, 12 years later, now I'm a recruiter, and I, I wouldn't have even imagined it. Another thing I would say is really just seize the opportunity to build relationships relationships with people, whether it's, you know, professionally or personally. I've met my best friends. I met my husband working at this company. So you truly are going to meet some incredible people. So really seize this opportunity because when you come on a program, four to seven months seems like infinity. It seems like forever, but you're going to blink and it's going to be over. So seize every moment that you possibly can. Well, as always, you guys asked and we answered. We have had so much fun talking about our memories and reminiscing on our college program experiences. And that's what we hope for you guys too, that you'll come on the program and have the time of your life and that you'll take away so many great things that will help you in your future. But you know what to do. Watch our social, watch our YouTube for more episodes of Ask Disney Programs.